Hi there, uh, Scott here again. Uh, I've got a question from a student about factors and levels in ANOVA. So basic definitions of factors are like, um, they're like independent variables. They're types of quantities that affect the outcome of what we're studying. Then levels are the values factors can take on. So we can look at an example to make this clear. And so if a researcher is looking at the month of a student's birth and their gender and testing whether that has an effect on their GPA, then so he's looking at the month of their birth and their gender. So those are two factors that he's studying. They're like independent variables and he's checking in if they have any effect on their GPA. So those are factors. Um, and then inside the factors for gender, there's male, uh, female, then for month of birth, January, February, up to December. So for gender, there's those two levels. And for month of birth, we've got 12 levels. I didn't write them all down, but that should be clear. And then we can take combinations of the levels. So like January and mail, February and mail, on down to December and mail. So we'll have the students grouped up into 24 different groups. We call those treatment conditions for each combination of the two levels. Okay, so I hope that makes sense. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Uh, otherwise, uh, have a good day.